Welcome back to the Let's Play The Last Federation. I'm the Fusilier, and hopefully that's a little bit better and I can actually be heard now. Yeah, this is quite a game. Uh, the reaction was pretty positive. It may be more positive now that I can be discerned from the music. That actually bothers me personally quite a bit. How dare this game drown me out. Okay. I have never seen a game that does what this one does. There, It may exist somewhere, but it's... I haven't seen a full-out strategy game, because this can only be called a strategy game. That is, a federation building game, as opposed to an empire building game, which is your standard 4X. Even in other games, like, a republic will go on an empire building spree. But this is the only one I've seen where you're not building ships, you're not building armies. There's a mode which is different that we're kind of... We'll kind of do that. First off, let's look at our flagship now that we have the ability to customize it. And just determine, you know, what we're gonna do. Energy blaster, gravity lance, minigun. Really, we just have these three guns there. Now, the offensive abilities and stuff, that's the, uh, that's the one where there's all sorts of stuff. Shields are at full, you have at least 25%. Hmm. All enemy ships that deploy other time. At only quarter speed, deploys a squadron of two ultra sacrifice ships. Ooh. <clears throat> All non subspace, non microwave shots have dangerous to all ships except the one that fired them. Ooh. This is lovely for those situations when we're surrounded by 40 billion assholes. That sounds... Operation Alter, Operation Clave. Two Mega Clave more. Let's just try these, but we're gonna, we're gonna try those abilities pretty soon, I think. Okay, we need to decide what to do. The situation is thus. Half the races have reached spacefaring technology yet, the other half have not. Until a race becomes spacefaring, everyone kind of leaves it alone, which is probably what's happening to us in real life. Hopefully. That's the good option. The other solutions to Fermi's paradox are uh, not so good. We've got to decide how to manage this situation. Now, the other races aren't going to be here for a while. Fortunately, the Burlus, who are jerk, are going to be half an hour. The Evox are kind of jerks, but meh. The Boring and the Evox are kind of the neutral. And I guess the Acutians could be considered neutral too. Whereas the Thoraxians are bad and evil. Although it is worth mentioning that the Andors, the Pelsians, and the Skylaxians, I consider them to be the good guys. They're not actually like friends with each other. Or us, really. Not yet. Well, they like us just fine. I think we're going to get the Skylaxians into space for the appeal boost. If we can manage it. They are only 10 minutes away, so they will be the next ones to come naturally. Which means we might just... If it's like completely impossible, we'll just uh, peel off and run. I'm hoping to do less like just sit here explain and more of doing and kind of showing you guys what this game is about by doing that and we'll see how it unfolds. As you can see, everyone... Actually, the only ones who will truly care are the Acutians. Skylaxians will be greatly help, uh, greatly thankful to us. The other ones, just five each, because they kind of know, like, yeah, the Skylaxians are kind of nice. I'm guessing the Acutians really oppose them. Okay. Huh. Yeah, our, our special abilities are mysteriously gone. Alright. Our same objective still applies. We go directly for the fucking drop point. The only bullets that we have to care about are the Acution satellites. You know, if the Andors get 5% more angry at us, I don't really care all that much. It is worth noting, yeah, as long as we avoid the Acution shots, Let's just head straight in, I mean, fucking, everyone else might get mad at us. 
Hold your fire, there's no point. Just move in at maximum power. Just don't let their their bullet curtains hit us. Cushions, cushions. I got a bad feeling these are gonna be the ones that hit us. Remember, we can take as much time as we need on this one. As long as we take that synchronous moment, and if the accusions do hate us, well, we tried. Go, 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 just go. Fuck it. It's getting to the point where we can't do that anymore. The Skylaxians are now spacefaring. They are an advanced species and yeah. disapprove of your race's past actions. However, they may just be the key to forming a federation, as their powers of persuasion over the other races are non-trivial. That's why I took that risk. Also, the large amount of credit you gain. The Andors and the Thoraxians like us 5% less, but, you know, it's bad losing interest with the Thoraxians, because I think we're already going down, but the Andors will be fine. We're still friends. And we have taken the Skylaxians to the stars and made them like us. See their population. Their da -da. A lot of these numbers are jibber jabber. They're they matter, but of course the good guys have a low compatibility with their planet. Like, of course, as you can imagine, low compatibility with your planet makes you worse at stuff. But it also makes you want to get other planets more. You know that you may be more compatible with. You see. So if an aggressive race has low compatibility with their planet, they may want to take others more. So maybe if they have a high compatibility, they'll be less likely to attack others, but they will be stronger. See, that's the deal. Anyhow, I guess the first thing we should do is go meet the local government. The Skylaxian Senate is an interplanetary body that makes all decisions for their race. The Skylaxians are seen as fair brokers by the other races. A good relationship with them can help you backdoor other races, if you know what I'm saying. Trouble is, the Skylaxians may take issues with our shady business. And you know, there's elections every time. Like I said, every race has a different political structure that works differently, which I think is super cool. So let's just see what's on offer. Nothing here yet, naturally. This may only open up when they're part of the Federation. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm. Costs an indeterminate number of... I think the Andors are our best bet for a secondary, like, power. Planetary Ion Cannon. Environmental changes. Ooh, is that just a... Oh, it has to be built. Alright, so that's good. This will take time. Not all that much, you know, 20 seconds. Local deals. Okay. It costs us 12 credit, and it will double the production of warships for 30 months. That sounds really, like easy stuff like <laughs> here's 12 bucks you bums get a fleet together you're gonna fucking need it and let's colonize their moon I mean let's do that get some trade routes you know going heck this is a pretty good way to spend our wow they got a lot of shit to do oh yeah Jesus guys how many fucking moons do you fuckers have? That's my that's my politics voice. What the fuck, guys? Okay, I can't just pass time like this without taking you know note. Steal temporary hide up from the obscure. Tea worms are on the rise. Just so you uh know, and don't go over there where they are. What? <clears throat> oh. Contacting teeth worms disease. Sorry, guys. 
All right, the Skylaxians are Jesus. They're spamming their Twitter. Jesus, guys. Okay, I think. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, we're definitely going to finish up. Mm. Now, it may be tempting to do something like let these guys die. That's not really on. Like, if they are suffering from a plague that is, like, wiping their people out. Huh. Even with the plague, they're still growing. Alright, guys, we'll help someone else. They don't typically need help. They typically are the people that make other people need help, if you know what I'm saying. Fuck it, let's keep doing this. Jesus, guys. I mean, we'll stop back in every couple just to make sure... That things are okay? What the fuck? What is this? Everyone else can get the space on their damn own. Oh, we could keep doing it, but... We're just gonna degrade the... The, uh... Friendship we got from... Uh, steal a temporary cure from Obscura Hideout for the Acutions. Our planet is being ravaged by disease. We've located an Obscura hideout. However... Okay... They'll like us better. We'll get a lot of money. A temporary cure, new special ability, if lost, ignored, or other contract taken. They want us to get the thing. Yeah. We do want to make friends with everyone, even the Accusions. There's only one quest. Alright, let's do it. Time for combat again. Simple. Destroy the enemies. Oh, that thing's big. Obviously our Giga Cannon does the most. This is just a straight up fight. This is just... I kinda wish there was an equalized power button. Okay. Standard power distribution. Auto targets the nearest enemy flash. The Giga Cannon, we can use this and skip our turn. I think before things get bad, we're gonna deploy our fighter squadrons and then Giga Cannon somebody. Uh, for 10 turns, become dangerous to all ships except the one that fired them. That's also cool. Also, when you use an ability, you get like a curtain that that like sweeps away bullets in your path. It's an arcadey thing, but you know, it's how it goes. Anyway, let's do this. Let's launch fighters right now. And then get the fuck out of the way, because they're coming. And hit these guys with the... You know what, fuck these guys. Let's... How do I go back? Can I go back? That's a good one to know. The Obscura are... I don't know what they are, but they're bad, so yeah. So what ifs. I don't like our fighters much. Should keep them a little busy. Wow, the Wolf Predator has 40,000 HP. I mean, ours is, like, better, but... Energy absorbers resist energy. This thing says it'll work. But it didn't. Just keep going alongside them and fire at your will. Just pour it on. Either. Energy absorbers res Okay, I get it, I get it. I get it. Bring us... 
like this. Switch to the minigun. Pour it on. Armored Holbers is ballistic. All right, bring us to this bearing and hit him with the grab lance. We should be in range. Yeah, that'll do it. I mean, we're getting hit too, naturally. I wonder. Sweep their bullets aside. We're gonna focus down this guy. Our fighters are keeping the rest of them pretty busy, it looks like. Wow, these guys are good. I was kind of expecting them to die instantaneously. All we gotta do is take this guy out and survive. Looks like his hole is down about 50%. This guy won't be doing it with us. If you know what I... God damn it. Just shoot him. It's a game of trying to outguess each other. Oh look, if if the um, if the end of the thing is like grayed out, that means we will come to a stop at the end of the turn. Whereas if we do this, we'll keep moving, which will affect our ability to move in the future. Naturally, keep on him with the grab lance. That there we go. It's two left. All right, bring us the fuck about. Find the next one. All right. Um. Take power from our weapons until we need it. Put them into shields so we survive the bullshit and bring us about to... Okay, where's the other stuff? There's one. I guess we just go that way. Friggin'... Those are shotgun bomb shots. I think those will clear up on their own, hopefully. Fuck it, let's bring about it this way. Just hope we don't get hit by too damn many. Let's get us some fancy flying gun. Oh, that's a long range shot. Yeah, there we go. We just need to regenerate a little bit. Wow, our fighters are shipping like halfway through that other guy. Let's get in there. We'll regenerate much faster if we're not actually being hit. Come here, you. You ain't getting away. Not today. I totally absorbed our mega cannon shot. Like a jerk. What? Am I misunderstanding something important? Anyhow, auto fire this guy. Huh. Oh, I get it. Standard distribution. Wow, he's fast. Man. Alright, bring us in closer. Get the grab lance ready to go. Something is weird. I wonder if deployment jammer works on their... Because those things were not fighters that were shooting us in patterns. They were like bomb shots. Looks like all of our fighters have pretty well passed on, or at least most of them, although they're doing serious work. This one doesn't appear to be too damaged, but that other guy is really getting it. Uh, they're gonna hit us anyhow. Let's let's try this and see which direction it goes. Hit him with the grab lands. Figured we should just run through the curtain of fire at this point. Whoa! God, this fucker! Try the minigun. He's resisting ballistics, but like... Feels like the grab lance is doing a lot. God damn it, Jesus! Okay, we gotta figure something out.
There we go. Alright, now we need to heal a little bit before we go back into the battle. Step one, maximum power to fucking Jesus. We gotta be careful. This other guy's healing too, but we really don't have a choice on this one. He's gonna be coming for our nuts now. Oh, he's going the other way. Looks like it's just us now, but those fighters bought us a lot of time that we would not otherwise have. Shields are basically back up, it looks like. Uh, if we lose, they'll hate us anyhow, as if we shouldn't have even bothered. I don't think losing means game over, but let's not, let's not try that. We need a plan. Let's see what we can do. It's fucking energy absorbers. This guy had. It looks like he's a very strong defender. Try this and see if he shoots himself. What's he doing? Oh, I see what he's doing. Bring us in. Yeah, I know. Also, having more power to shields means that your shields take less damage, like inherently. Alright, this is the path he's going, so curve our path in the same direction. Can we do the grav lance? I think so. Yeah, we can. Oh my god. Fuck this guy. Every one of his shots hurts so fucking bad. And he's regenerating, of course. Damn it, what do I do? <sighs> I don't mind saying that the actual combat is not the part of this game that appealed to me. All non-subspace, non-microwave shots. The road shot. Giga Cannon miss him or some shit? I think it did. That upsets me greatly. That's, that's a bad thing to waste. Okay. Fuck it, dodge around until we're ready to fight again. Fuck this guy. I guess the minigun's a little better. Wait a second, is that guy okay? He's acting weird. Alright, come here, you fucker. What's the range? That should be within our range, like... Or not. Fuck off. We just gotta figure out how to dodge this guy. That's a lot of damage we just did. Like a lot, wow. Do that again. With our weapons turned down. He's obviously not too strong either. There's a sweet spot. I can tell. 
Let him hit us. the thing. Jesus. Oh, I was wondering why we weren't seeing this stuff. Yep. These are like the RCI indicators. In fact, they are the RCI indicators. These represent how good their environment, their economy, and their health is. Let's talk about trends. The planet can only be trending up or down one direction, and only in one category. Which means, starting a positive trend somewhere will cancel a negative trend elsewhere, and so on. It's much easier to start a positive trend than just to make something a lot better immediately. Stop that, please. Yep. Planetary advice. Hey, buddy. Huh. So, yes. We've helped the Acutians with their problem. It took a little while. gained a pretty good amount of credits. They really fucked us up. Yeah. Anyhow, it's gonna be what it's gonna be. We should give these guys a diplomat. Well, while we're here. What do you guys think about us? The Acutians were the ones who uh, handle things. They're capitalist robots. That's pretty much... Yep. You are nothing but the blah blah blah. Blah blah. Hey man. We all do our best here. Not represented by any of the. Okay, who is the CEO? Yeah, we need to get us to at least zero influence. Is there anything we can do here that's. I don't want missions from you because you'll get mad when I don't do them. The only pirate bases belong to this race and they don't want to do that. This is like a sustained, yeah, this is a, dis a sustained. This is a, uh, they probably don't trust us enough for this year. 12 minutes is a lot. This is, yeah, as mentioned, this is a condition. Because... Oh, they're medical as well. We might not be able to do planetary advice until we hit, like, zero. Alright, fine, guys. Suit yourself. Medical trending down. Yeah. Jesus. We've just unlocked the stats that reveal how bad we suck. Economic downtrend.
Our friends are all... Well, I mean, right now it's going up. Okay, let's go see what we can do with the Skylaxians right now, I think. That's what I'll do. I mean, we could help the Borings. We could do it with literally every race to make them like us. I don't know. We're working on the Acutians over time. We're on the right track with them, actually, because we're helping them out. Hey, guys. These are nice because they're cheap, they don't cost time. We just kind of help them decide what to do. We'll start construction of a building on Fergus. Cool. Yeah, let's do that. That's really cheap. It helps them. They like it. Like, we're rolling in credits now. We should do these kind of deals while we can. Okay, industrialize... Sometimes the only... Yeah. Gain 50 economic. 40 environment. Oof. That's the trade. Negative economic trend. Positive public order trend. Well... God, I mean, of course, this will just... Wait, can we do this multiple times? Is, can there only be, like, one deal active? at a time. Whatever, guys. Build more stuff. Okay, they suck in everything, so it's... Medicine is the one thing we don't have to worry about, so we have to think environment or economy. Now, this is tough, because I tend to ignore environmental issues, but... That will lead to big consequences, and I think, let's start with the e positive economic trend, guys. Yeah. We need to get you guys built up so you can stand up to these nerves, and every... What is this? What the heck? Anyhow, let's let time advance a little bit, just so there isn't some giant thing that happens without us noticing. Ugh, another computer virus. LXA isn't really deadly, but it sure is going to put a dent in their industry. Ooh, another disease. Yeah. Hey, I was trying to help you guys. Just keep an eye on that population. Zero per month, zero per month. They're not going down. Okay, let's start some positive trends on some of these other planets. Oh yeah, it's trending up. Economic is not trending anywhere, so let's handle that. 